Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you are new to my channel, I would like to tell you I made tutorials on graphics designing usually. Today we are going to learn that how to create a website banner. I will use some pictures as well as clip arts which you have already seen from the thumbnail. So let's get started. I am taking a new document. I am taking the size of 1000 multiplied by 300 and a resolution of 300. You can take according to your need which varies website to website. In this tutorial, I will speak at those where I think it's important to tell you about something as I am using voiceover hopefully you will understand this. I will write down the instructions while editing this video. As you can see there are big lines, let's merge them by taking masks on those layers. Simply paint with black to hide and paint with white to reveal that again on the mask. Select all the layers and press Ctrl plus Alt plus C to merge the selected layers into a new layer. I am making the other three layers a group, so that these layers don't disturb us in the future while working. Press Ctrl plus T to transform. I am flipping this as I want to put these decorations on the back of our model head. Make the selection of subject you can take any tool in which you are expert, or you can simply go into select and then select a subject which will automatically select your subject, which usually doesn't work perfectly on the light color background, so I have taken quick selection tool. Press alt while using quick selection to deselect the object. If you hold the ALT key while taking the mask, it will invert the mask. When the pen toolpath got completed, if you will press CTRL plus ENTER, it will make the selection of that, which is a short key to making a selection.
Press Ctrl plus 0 to fit the image on the canvas. Let's merge this patch too. I am again taking a mask and painting with black to hide the sharp edge. X is a short key to toggle between foreground and background color. Another way to make a selection is that simply go to select then color range and select that you want to target and increase the fuzziness and you done. Look how beautifully it has removed the white background.
please tell in the comments box which one you like number one or number two. If you like my content and have not subscribed yet, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Do share with your friends and colleagues. Don't forget to like and share. Thanks for watching.